With Lunar New Year just around the corner, San Francisco's Chinatown is lighting up with some new lanterns. But these aren't just any lanterns. They're a nod to the neighborhood's history with an artistic twist. Here's ABC7 News reporter Tara Campbell. Ready? One, two, three. Look up! And just like that, San Francisco's Chinatown lights up in a way never seen before. Tonight we are unveiling a new lantern here on Grant Avenue. Joanne Lee is the executive director of Edge on the Square, a contemporary art hub in the heart of Chinatown. You've probably seen kind of the iconic red lanterns that have been up and down Grant Avenue and other streets in Chinatown. We commissioned a very special contemporary lantern to integrate with the existing red lanterns. Commissioning Bay Area artist Brie Gibson to take on the project. I really um, was asked to merge contemporary art and still give homage to the traditional culture and kind of create a bridge between the two. The Oakland native taking great care in creating the new look lanterns. I really wanted to take special care and make sure that I gave nod to the work and really research and it, it was really fascinating and researching this community that I've been in so many times and spending a lot of time here so I think that naturally trickled through the work as I made it. A lot of our programming here at Edgeon Square is multi generational. So it's thinking about um, honoring the heritage and the past and connecting it with the future. They are really at the cutting edge of avant-garde art. Supervisor Aaron Peskin joining the night celebration, encouraging people to come check it out, especially ahead of Lunar New Year. They're welcoming people from far beyond Chinatown. I mean, this is meant for the people of San Francisco, Asian, not Asian, and for people around the Bay Area. One of our goals is to increase foot traffic and visitors to Chinatown to, you know, not only check out the arts and culture, seen here but also to you know shop in the stores and um, eat in the restaurants. It was so wild to see it manifest into like our 3D reality and now it's up and people get to experience it and you know the creative process you're like how's it gonna turn out? It's a surprise to me too. Tara Campbell, ABC7 News.